Sure is stinky. We are at the Old Faithful Geyser. No, do not expect it to be this uncrowded when you come to visit, unless you plan to get up at zero in the morning. And the smoke has changed. Yeah, so the steam was going off to the side. Now it's going up. <laughs> That's, That's That is so cool. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know. It's weird to me that there can be one right in the middle of the trees, and the trees are all growing just fine. And then these ones, there's nothing by them. Ooh, 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 ooh. It was making a noise. Yeah, it was making noise. So, I think it's coming. I'm scared. <laughs> Rick, be it quiet. Is so <laughs> coming soon, coming soon. Crowds are growing, crowds are growing. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Black Sand Basin. Notice the black sand. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, Mimi! Mimi! Whoa! Whoa! This is called the Cliff Geyser. Reagan, get down. Wow, this is fantastic. Gonna have to say, I highly recommend Yellowstone. Super awesome. Looks like the kind of place you'd see a bunch of dinosaurs. Turn around, babies, look at mommy. Look at all those fun colors from all the wacky stuff that's in the ground. Look how cool that is. It's all bumpity. See, it looks like it's going to explode. I know. Don't you just want to get in? Yes. And that one looks like it's And soothe all of your muscles, your aches and pains. Whoa, they're really acting up. Whoa. Whoa. They're out of control. Yeah, I just want to get in there and soak. Yeah. Probably boil to death, but but it would be fun. What'd you find, Meme? Is it so pretty? Is it beautiful? Mm -hmm. I love it. This one is called Green Spring. I can barely see the water. I know, but if you could, it's a beautiful color. Sure is stinky. What's this one called? Well, Olivia wants to go over there. Oh, it stinks bad. Oh, boy, that's nasty. Next stop on the list is Biscuit Basin, Reagan's Biscuit Basin. He's excited. We saw it when we were on our way to our camping place. I saw it. Lulu saw it and Reagan was so excited it. about oh. it being called Biscuit Basin. <laughs> Turn around, Reggie. Yeah, good rules too. And no uh, droids. 
drones. <laughs> no, he's not allowed here. So it was freezing when we got out this morning, but it is already warming up quite a bit. Yeah. Reagan is now in jams and a t-shirt. <laughs> Lulu is still in her jams. She doesn't want to get changed in the van. And she didn't get changed in the tent. Look how pretty that is in kind of a pukey kind of a way. <laughs> right? They're not supposed to. Naughty, naughty. I almost wanted to just fall in. Which uh, on that sign, it showed a Yes, I did just say that I kind of wanted to just fall in. I am that kind of a person. You're evil. Yes, I am evil. <laughs> or I just want people to follow the rules. Even though I have many times said that rules are made to be broken, but not when it comes to our national treasures. Black Opal Spring. Where's a park ranger when you need one? Well, yes. I'm trying to decide if that's litter out there in that stream. It is. Can't do anything about it because I'm not going to get off the path. I will. And yes, I am just the... No, you will not. No son of mine. I am the kind of person that tells people to get back onto the wooden paths. And yes, the lady that I was saying I hoped fell in, I did tell her <laughs> that she needed to be on the wooden paths. <laughs> because I am the kind of person that speaks up when it comes to things like this. Well, not just dangerous. Yeah, definitely dangerous. But also, respect, guys. Have some respect. Look at this. I mean, geez, it's not the place to throw your garbage. It's not the place to be climbing around other than on the wooden pathways. Path. Holy mother. Oh, That's deep. what? Yeah. Are you seeing this, guys? I'd probably be able to sit right there if we could. Jeez. But that's deep. Jeez. That may be the coolest thing I've ever seen, Reagan. I'd say that's cooler than Old Faithful, even. Mm -hmm. Good grief. It's a pool. It's a pool. Dang. Oh, I wish you guys could see this. It is called, well, aptly called, Sapphire Pool. That looks like something on another planet. What was that 80s movie? Was it called Blue Lagoon? No, it wasn't Blue Lagoon. Where, like... The old people went into those pods with the aliens, and the aliens, like, they were in pods in a pool. Not this kind of pool, but like a regular swimming pool. What was that movie called? Mm. I saw it when I was a kid. Anyway, this totally makes me think of that. This is like a place where aliens would be, for sure. Wow! Oh! It's a funny name. Avoca Spring. Wow! I know! How cool is that? Man, that's awesome. No, let's go down that trail. We already did. No, oh, no. way down there? Alright. Come on, Nima! We stopped at the Great Fountain Geyser. It should be a pretty big show, but it'll be a long time before it's likely to erupt. It has a really big time frame of when it will erupt, not nearly as consistent or predictable as Old Faithful. So we probably won't stay here very long. But Daddy and Olivia are having lunch over at the van. So Mommy and Mimi, who was picking her nose, and Reagan, we are over here hanging out. We got to see this one shooting when we were over at whatever the other one was called. So that was cool. And I thought this was the fountain paint pot, but it's not. It is the white dome geyser. Pretty awesome though. How old is it? Centuries old. I would have thought older, so that's kind of cool.
now we are at Firehole Lake. This is insane. The whole lake. Crazy, huh? Yeah. And steaming the whole thing. I could feel it when I got out of the car. I could feel the Isn't that nuts? It's a real fun, active one over there. We'll go see that. But I'm just amazed at the whole lake. Mike, can we go on the walking? Yeah. Ah, uh, honey. This is the young, hopeful geyser. And it's just bouncy and happy. Doing its thing, huh, Mimo? Right. <laughs> Mimi's got a pretend camera. It's real. Oh, it's real, and it's a Pokemon card camera. My kids have the best imaginations. Love it. A whole steaming lake. Seriously, guys. A whole steaming lake. So, I'm showing the kids. This is why you stay on the boardwalk. You see how thin that crust is? And this whole section has collapsed. No idea when, how recently, but yeah, the whole thing has collapsed. And that's why lunatic people should not be out and about on it. Crazy. You just fall right in. Ouch! Now we're at the fountain paint pots. It's pretty awesome. Pretty stinky. But pretty awesome. Okay, probably the coolest thing so far. This is the dragon's mouth. It even makes noises. That is insane. It keeps making all those fun noises. Oh! Do you love it, guys? Mm -hmm. Dang, that's awesome. It makes me think that there's a water dragon in there. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's so cool. That's like, mm, 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 mm. What's probably happening is it's kind of like a miniature geyser inside of it, where it keeps moving up and down and up and down. Mimi, do you like it? And it pushes it out. You can see out the side, it like shoots out these waves of water. Now the mud volcano. Oh. Wow. Man, that's wacky stuff. It stinks like cow manure right That's here. That's one of the ones I was most excited to see was this. And so can you take a picture of me? Yeah. That is amazing. I wonder how deep it is. It doesn't say on the sign. Now, Dragon's Cauldron, and it's so awesome that dead root system there looks like a carcass the remains of something the dragon ate pretty awesome imagination you know oh this is mud cauldron yeah, one of you on each side of the sign, huh? It says Mammoth Spring up at the north end of the park. All right, ready? Beautiful and crazy. So there's the water coming down right there, but you've got all these funky white fluffy steps, and then it looks like a quilt up there. Bizarre. And then that looks like icicles. So cool. <laughs> we have seen some amazing things. Mimi's pooped. She has not been feeling so good, but she's been a trooper, huh? So crazy. And then there's all that just cascading down. Making more of this. It does, doesn't it? It's wacky.
making more of this fluffy stuff, quilt looking. It does, it just looks like a bundled up quilt. Beautiful. We are at the Norris Geyser Basin area. I've got my Mimi here with me. There's the kids and dad. Daddy, Reggie, and Lulu. And boy, does it stink. But we've got a beautiful overcast day. Well, it wasn't earlier, but now it is. Here it is. This is called Solfaterra. Ooh. That little bubbling deal right there. Oh, it it's just it's like being on a different planet except that you've got all these gorgeous pine trees but then you come walking up on this and you're like whoa beam me up Scotty where the heck am I you fall in that sucker sorry friends that's all she wrote. Bubbly, bubbly. Huh, Mimo? Mm -hmm. oh. oh, a body of government. Making improvements, that's nice. We are walking up on the northern, oh, Norris Geyser Basin, otherwise known as Mars. Good grief. Okay, Mars, that's just me, but geez Louise. Look at that. Jeez. Oh, I wish you guys could be here to see this. It's bizarre and beautiful. It reminds me of an oil slick. fantastic it's like all blue right there. I know isn't it beautiful this is the steamboat geyser it's freaking awesome it's just going and going and going it's gigantic it's huge So apparently this constant activity is just a really lucky event for us. Sometimes it'll take 50 years for it to finally erupt. Yeah, and this is not normal. It just happens to be happening while we are here. This is not its big burst. Its big burst would be like way up there and happened the other day. Day before we got here actually. And it doesn't normally do this. Biggest geyser in the whole park. Look at that base of it. Good grief. I'd like to think it's happening just for us. Oh, that's amazing. Very, very impressive. Anywho, don't expect it to be doing this when you're here. If it is, awesome. If not, I mean, it is what it is. Unpredictable. So glad we get to see it, though. 